Hey, what's up you guys, it's Hideaki Nomura, and in this video, I'll be showing you my new desk setup for 2020, where I do video editing and also some gaming as well. Before 2020, my desk setup was pretty bad. It was an old desk. Um, I would say it's very clumped up, as you can see. You know, my, my iMac right here, and then another gaming monitor right on the corner. So I got a new desk, an L-shaped desk for the corner. So I built it together. It's very spacious. Now I have one side for gaming, one side for video editing, and a little small corner right there where I could do maybe some overhead shots. And it was simple to build, and I like to keep it minimal. So as you can tell, you can't really see that many cables on the bottom, but on the top, of course, you could see the cables for like the mouse, the keyboard, and maybe like the charging cables for my phone and for other stuff. But yeah, for the most part, you can tell no cables. I spent a decent amount of time doing some cable management. So I use a lot of things for cable management, cable ties, zip ties, whatever, the twisty things. Twisty ties, twist ties, twisties, twisties. Yeah, I use that a lot and um, 3M tape, these little cable hooks or cable mount for the wall. Let me just give you a quick rundown of my desk. So right here I got the iMac, it's the 2015 5K Retina display. It's not the finished product, I might get a riser just to kind of raise up the, the iMac. So I could put like the keyboard and also the MacBook. So I can, you know, probably charge it, you know, cause the way I have it charged up right now is like this. I just want to make it look clean, make it look better. So it's a work in progress. I'm not so sure because it seems like there's not going to be that much space though. So, and I also got this headset right here for video editing. And these are the Sony MDR 1000X. So on the corner right here, it's my light that I got on Amazon. It has a USB port on the side so you could plug in a charger. It's very good light, very bright as you can tell. And then right here I have my gaming setup. So I also got this Asus gaming monitor on Amazon. It's, it's one millisecond. I think it's 60 hertz. It's 1080p max resolution. I got the mouse and keyboard. So I got the Logitech G502 mouse. Very good mouse. I love it a lot. I love this infinity scroll. Yeah, and I like how you can customize the different buttons. And also if you plug it into your computer and download the program, you could change the DPI settings. There's a lot of things that you could change, different colors, LED, you know, I'm not gonna get so much into it, but it's a great mouse. I love it. I also just got this keyboard and mouse pad on Amazon. I think I also got a mouse with it, but it's not the best mouse. So that's why I switched to the G502. So yeah, got the Xbox One S right here and I also got the headphones down here for gaming. So right here behind the gaming monitor is my charging station for my cameras, for my Canon 80D, for my Sony A7 III, and this, the MPF batteries, and also anything else that I have to charge with USB or just anything I have to charge, honestly. So behind the iMac, I have a bunch of hard drives. I think it's about 40 terabytes worth. So that's pretty much it for the video. I hope you found it informative and helpful. I hope that this video can help you with your new desk setup and maybe make it look cleaner, more minimal, just something that can help you be more productive with your workflow, your space. One of the main reasons why I wanted to change it is just because I just felt so cramped and like just the space wasn't so inspirational or just, I just felt stuck. I need to change. So it's a brand new year. That's why I wanted to change it, make it look nice, make it a place where I want to be as much as possible, but also of course have space to kind of be free and not feel so cluttered. It kind of does feel nice having a clean setup and I don't know, I just feel so, ooh, feels good. So I hope that you can feel good about your space as well. It will take some time and investment to make your space look clean. It took me a couple hours um, to clean up the space and also to take me some time to set up the desk and we arrange certain things. So please be patient, but I promise you, you will enjoy your new workspace. So yeah, that's it. I hope it helped. Thank you so much. 
please click that like button if you liked it, enjoyed it, and also click that subscribe button as well so that you can be updated or notified when I upload new content. So thank you so much. Peace out. Much love.